Hey, what's up, my fearless networking friend, Todd Falcone, what's going on? So, all right, probably a fairly short episode today, but nonetheless, a very important one. All right, so here's the deal. When we go out there and we're presenting our products or presenting our business, uh, we take people through a process. We're either sampling our products and allowing them to take a look at them and check it out and smell it and taste it and feel it or whatever, or we're uh, marketing our business side of the equation and we're putting people through a, a some type of presentation. Maybe you're sending to a video or a series of videos. Maybe they're on a Zoom opportunity presentation or however you're presenting it. And when we get to the end of that process, when we get to the end of that process, what typically happens? Well, we're looking to collect a decision, right? We get to the end of the process and it's either yes, no, or I've got questions that I need to get addressed and we uh, help address those questions that somebody might have. And to help them, you know, figure out what, you know, do, do, do you want to go? You want to run with us or is it no? Either one, right? Now, here's the thing. When, when you get to the end of the process and let's say somebody is unsure and, and look, you've no doubt have experienced this or they're like, oh, I'm not sure. It's like, I don't have the money, which to me, like if they don't have the money is like the, probably one of the biggest reasons why should, they should do the business anyhow. If you don't have the money, well, how are things going to, like, if you don't do something different, how's that going to ever change for you? Like, how long do you want to continue to say, I don't have the money? And here's the deal. This close that I'm going to share with you, and I'm not like, you know, when we're talking about like traditional sales, there's like, I don't know, there's a bunch of different closes that you can do. The puppy dog close, the this close, the either or close or whatever. Um, I don't typically do any of those things when, when we're, you know, enrolling somebody in network marketing. But there's one thing that you can do that I think, if you're not, uh, if you don't have this in your wheelhouse, it's important you put this into your wheelhouse. So, and I call it the, the guarantee close. Uh, and this is essentially what the gist is. Most of your companies have some type of guarantee, right? Maybe you have a 30 day money back guarantee or 30 day empty bottle money back guarantee. Maybe you have a 60 day money back guarantee. Uh, maybe even on, and that's from a product standpoint, and perhaps even if somebody were to enroll as a distributor, the company also provides some type of guarantee. And what is a guarantee? A guarantee is risk mitigation, right? So in other words, it allows somebody to come in and try something. They got to pay the money to do it, but if they're not fully satisfied that within a specific time frame they can get their money back, right? So let's say you get to the end of this journey with somebody and they want to try your products, but they're like, well, I don't know. I just, I'm not sure. And I'm like, hey, brother, you know what? Look, I, let, me, let me share something with you. And, and I, I wouldn't bring this out until, like, unless they're like, you know, kind of balking at the end of it. I'm not really sure. And you're trying to get them over the edge to make a decision. I could say, hey, you know, listen, Joe, I'll tell you what, this is something that, that the, this company offers. They offer a, 30 day unconditional empty bottle money back guarantee. In other words, you can buy the products, you can use all of them. And if within 30 days you're like, mm, no, I don't really like this stuff. You can get hundred percent of your money back. So you get a full chance to like use these products and see what they do in your body. And if you're not hundred percent satisfied, look, I'll even help you get the refund. I'll help you. If you're like at the end of 30 days, you're like, Hey, I didn't really feel anything or didn't work for me or I don't like this stuff or made me feel weird or whatever their thing is. You, you, by bringing up the guarantee, it helps them to realize, oh, I don't really have anything to risk. And so if you're not, if you don't have this in your wheelhouse, if you're not thinking about this, when you got somebody who's, you know, ready to essentially try the products that you offer and you're not going, hey, look, we've got this, is this guarantee. It's important, number one, you know what the guarantee is. You need to know 100% what is the guarantee that your company provides. Is it 30 days? Is it 60 days? Is it just for the products? Uh, do you have a guarantee if somebody signs up as a distributor in your company or rep in your company that if they, you know, if they participate for 30 days and they're like, ah, I just don't really want to do it anymore, that they can get their money back? Because then they're going to be way more inclined to make that financial decision because they feel comfortable knowing they've got nothing to risk and everything to gain. You follow me? So 
I think that if you just simply, number one, go look at what is your company's guarantee on your products or services and or your business opportunity and then be really clear on it. When you get to the end of this process and somebody's like not quite sure, you can utilize this guarantee to help them make that decision. And I, I've, I have enrolled way too many people to even count by simply sharing that guarantee with people when they're, uh, I'm not really quite sure. Well, that helps them, you know, it just helps them be more comfortable in making that decision. So that's called the guarantee close. And it simply involves you utilizing the guarantee. Secondly, I'll say this, very seldom can I recall, in fact, I cannot really even think of a situation, now I'm sure it probably happened, where they actually utilized the guarantee and they got their money back. So it's not like you're gonna use it you know, uh, 10 times and nine out of those 10 people are gonna say, I want my money back. You know, you might do it 10 times and one out of the 10 you know, end up taking advantage of that money back guarantee. Um, and that's fine. And I don't even, I don't even know if that, those are the percentages, but I would say most people don't end up utilizing the guarantee, but it just makes them feel comfortable in parting with money to either, you know, sample your products or services or get started in your business. So if you're not using that, make sure you kind of keep that in your wheelhouse and take advantage of that when you have somebody that's in that kind of situation where they're not quite ready to make a decision. So uh, love the fact that you're plugging into me. I do appreciate it. Hopefully you're getting good stuff out of uh, these episodes that I've been putting out for a very long period of time. Uh, you may be on my YouTube channel. What's up, YouTubers? If you're on my podcast, listen to me on audio. That's great as well. Uh, the rest of the details from this episode, as well as other great resources to help you be successful uh, in network marketing or direct selling, you'll find at toddfalcone.com forward slash episode 110. Again, toddfalcone.com forward slash episode 110. So thank you so much for being here. We'll see you next time. Have an amazing day.